Hello everyone, this is Ekatna here. So in this video, we are going to resolve a proper fraction into partial fractions. Let's get started. Resolve the fraction into proper fractions. So we are given a fraction. So firstly, we'll check whether it is a proper fraction or improper fraction. Okay. Let it be a P of X by Q of X where P of X equals to 5X plus 6 and Q of X equals to 2 plus X into 1 minus X. Okay. So we have considered the given fraction as P of X by Q of X where P of X equals to 5X plus 6 and Q of X equals to 2 plus X into 1 minus X. Okay. So here the degree of P of X is 1 and the degree of Q of X is 2 minus 2X plus X minus X square which is equals to 2 minus X minus X square. The degree is 2. Okay. The degree of Q of X is 2. So the degree of P of X is less than degree of Q of X. So here degree of P of X is less than degree of Q of X. So therefore the given fraction is a proper fraction. Therefore the given fraction is a proper fraction. So, we are given a proper fraction. Now, we are going to resolve it into partial fractions. Okay. Solution. The given proper fraction is 5x plus 6 by 2 plus x into 1 minus x. Okay. Let us consider the fraction. The proper fraction 5x by 5x plus 6 by 2 plus x into 1 minus x. So we can write it as a by 2 plus x plus b by 1 minus x. Consider it as equation 1. Okay. So, you can write it as the LHS part remains the same but in the RHS you are going to take the LCM of 2 plus x and 1 minus x which is 2 plus x into 1 minus x. If you want you can check it. Okay. 2 plus x 1 is 2 plus x. 1 minus x. So 2 plus x into 1 minus x is a LCM of 2 plus x in and 1 minus x. In the numerator you will get a into 1 minus x plus b into 2 plus x. Okay. So this becomes 5x plus 6 by 2 plus x into 1 minus x equals to a into 1 minus x plus b into 2 plus x by 2 plus x into 1 minus x. Okay, now you can cancel 2 plus x, 2 plus x, 1 minus x and 1 minus x. So you will get 
5 x plus 6 equals to a into 1 minus x plus b into 2 plus x. Consider it as equation 2. Okay. So now we have to consider 1 minus x. Let 1 minus x equals to 0. Then which means we will put 1 minus x equals to 0 and 2 plus x equals to 0. After that, we will substitute the value of x in the equation 2 and we will find the values of a and b. So, we will get x equals to plus 1. Okay. See. 1 equals to x. I am taking this minus x to right hand side. Okay. Let's say put better. Okay. Now, substitute x equals to 1 in equation 2. Substitute x equals to 1 in equation 2. Then 2 becomes 5 into 1 plus 6 equals to a into 1 minus x equals to 1. Plus b into 2 plus x equals to 1. So, you get 5 into 1 is 5. Plus 6 equals to a into 0. Plus b into 2 plus 1 is 3. Okay. So, you get 5 plus 1, 6 is 11. Equals to 0 plus 3b. So, from this you will get 3b equals to 11 and b equals to 11 by 3. Okay. So, therefore, b equals to, you are having 11 by 3. Good. So, next. We will consider 2 plus x and we will put 2 plus x equals to 0. Put 2 plus x equals to 0 then x equals to minus 2. Now substitute substitute x equals to minus 2 in equation 2. Then 2 becomes 5 into 2, 5 into minus 2 plus 6 equals to a into 1 minus or minus 2 plus b into 2 minus 2. So, this becomes 0. We will get 5 into minus 2 is minus 10. Plus 6 equals to a into 1 minus into minus plus 2 plus b into 2 minus 2 is 0. Okay. So minus 10 plus 6 is minus 4 equals to a into 1 plus 2 is 3 plus 0. So from this you will get 3a equals to minus 4. Again you will get a equals to minus 4 by 3. Okay, a equals to minus 4 by 3. Therefore, a equals to minus 4 by 3 and b equals to 11 by 3. Now, we are going to substitute these values in equation 1. Substitute a, b values in equation 1. Okay. So, firstly, we will write equation 1. 
which is 5x plus 6 by 2 plus x into 1 minus x equals to a by 2 plus x plus b by 1 minus x. Okay. Now substitute the values of a and b. We'll get 5x plus 6 by 2 plus x into 1 minus x equals to a minus 4 by 3 by 2, x, 2 plus x plus b is 11 by 3 by 1 minus x. So this becomes 5x plus 6 by 2 plus x into 1 minus x equals to minus 4 by 3 into 2 plus 6 plus 11 by 3 into 1 minus x. So you can, you can also write it as 5x plus 6 by 2 plus x into 1 minus x equals 2. Take the positive term first and negative term next. Okay. So here you can take 1 by 3 common from these two terms. If needed you can use it. Okay. 5x plus 6 by 2 plus x into 1 minus x equals to 1 by 3 into, see I am taking 1 by 3 common from these two terms. 1 by 3 into 11 by 1 minus x minus 4 by 2 plus x. Okay. So this completes the problem. So therefore, Five x plus six by two plus x into one minus x equals to eleven by three into one minus x minus four by three into two plus x. Okay, we have resolved the given proper fraction into partial fractions. So we have seen a problem in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then, bye-bye.